Ukrainians, why they use the oil or not? They know they told them to keep. If they told them to be fine, they know me. So that's why right. some people say, fine, you can use the oil. You have your father go to sprinkle a little and get your hands uh, and feet as happy as you think are good. Fine. But if you're using only oil to try and you have to it, you are giving yourself an antidepressant. Because it's written as a different task. When you're exposed to very high temperatures and repeated crying, the oil changes the task of much faster. So we are saying that even with our usual oil, everything you must retain. And then use this right. So like you said, the replacement will go down to the grassroots. We are doing so many things. If you are a man to do something with you, we all run after it and you start abusing it. So let's be very cautious. <laughs> I would rather use something like common oil or palm oil for time. Because I know that although they have saturated cars, they can withstand very high temperatures. So I'm not there with that. And there's a trick if you are using orange as a very slight oil for frying. When you use it for frying your fish, use it to cook in your fish that is when you to cook your stew and just use it up. Don't keep it. Next time you cook it, you fry it again. Another time you cook it, you fry it again. You end up destroying your oil. So even how we go about using these things, we hear that it's very important. But everything in your kitchen, olive oil, oil is good. Don't go and pour a cup of it on your salad. You're getting too much fat. This is also not good. Thank you. Can only come and say, come and test if you have said that this and product contains this. Then they will have to verify whether it actually contains it and at the levels that you have indicated on the on the on the testing. And then we also need education of the general public so yes. that the general public will know because if we label the food and FDA test and the labels are there and it is correct and we go and we don't even read the label. What what is that? And in Canada we don't read the label. So, excuse me to say, uh, he goes to buy a biscuit and he opens a biscuit before, before he realizes that the biscuit doesn't taste right. You see, so if he, if he goes to buy a biscuit and doesn't even check the expiry date before taking it to the house, what about that? So, if the labeling is very important, checking whether what is on the label is actually what is in the product is very important. But educating the people to read the labels is also very, very important. And this is why we should be having tools. So it is, we should be doing things concurrently. We are working towards the regulation. We are working towards infrastructure, resources. And then we are also working towards empowering people, giving people education to be able to make use of them. Fantastic, <laughs> We are not stupid. The women of Ghana are not stupid. A Juma Pia Mube Yesu Yeke, in TSE, a dress up MPP, Jomu Dia, Yenu, and Yakra and Yakra, Omunjai, and the women of Ghana are looking. So, Mube Tima, you are Mankasa Nifasa, a bummy song, be here more than that. In T, yeah, yeah, carry as a political party. Yeah, yeah, catch the president, he said, on fun and nine feet from. Okay.